party time. It, it's time to get out of here. It's Hugh asked the mom's about to get his son back. Ten-year-old Tony going home after a six-week drama. Always believe in yourself as much as others believe in you, and I believe in you, Tony. A life-and-death battle with H1N1. Within a day of catching the flu, Tony was hooked to life support in the intensive care unit of Children's Hospital in Oklahoma City. After three weeks, the fifth grader finally opened his eye. There you are. Gradually got well enough to leave the hospital for this rehab clinic. I'm trying. Use both hands if you want to. Tony is still weak, but over 11 days here, his strength and endurance improved. It's hard, huh? <laughs> Complete recovery could take a year. And how long did you think you had slept for? Uh, I thought I slept for a few days, but uh, now, but my dad told me it was a few weeks. <laughs> what did you think when you, he told you that? I was, I was, I thought he was kidding. <laughs> There was a time when this would have been unimaginable. Yeah, yeah. This, this wasn't, this wasn't even in our, in our focus at all. Um, what our focus was, was seeing him breathe by himself. Letitia Howard was as critically ill as Tony. You gotta fight through this, baby. But she improved and will also soon leave the ICU. Yes, it's a miracle to see that my baby's doing better. Never would have expected it a month ago. No. But two rooms away, Natasha Hart's bed is now empty. It's gonna be okay, Tasha. Yeah. It's gonna be all right. On Monday night, the eighth grade honor student died of H1N1 complications. <laughs> it's a homecoming to remember for eight-year-old Samantha Eslambaugh. Hi, Tony. And four-year-old Zachary. Thank you, buddy. We got him. Oh. The whole situation didn't seem real, but now that he's home again, it doesn't seem real either yet. It will. Doing great, son. Six weeks ago, Hugh Eslenbaum saw his son lie in a drug-induced coma. Today, over his shoulder, Tony naps on the couch. It's been a long time. I'm looking forward to it. I'm... Yeah. Looks great, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks really good. It's my boy. <laughs> Their boy is back. Their family complete. Uh, everybody hug Tony. Zachary, give us a big old hug. Oh, oh, we're all back. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Oklahoma City.